But I'm aware that there are even some of those who've been recently elected who may be of that mindset, who may be seeing the next five years as a time of opportunity for themselves. But I need to say, and it starts with me, that for so long as the good Lord gives me breath, I am going to rally against that. Because we need to set a new standard. We need to commit ourselves to this notion that we are going to serve, we are not going to be served. There are policies in, in, in place where councillors get one stand per, per five years. I have no problem with that. It's an onerous task, but that's where it has to end. And we have to have total transparency. And we need to have deep in, introspection to see that if we are trying to get on particular committees so that we get a benefit for ourselves, then that has to end. And I want to, to make certain commitments to you today, just starting with myself. And it's partly because Inyati is here. Uh, Paul, I came here in a black Mercedes Benz this morning, I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, but it's been, it's been with the council for about nine years. Okay? I, I, I'm captured, yeah. But what I'm undertaking to you in the presence of these witnesses is that that, that car is sufficient for my entire term. Right? I'm not going to... I, I'm not going to get a new mayoral vehicle for the five years. This has been recorded. You can... Bring this back to me, okay? Unless it totally breaks down and unless we have got our full complement of ambulances. How can we have new mayoral vehicles when we only have five ambulances? When we should have 30? And it's just nonsense. It's absolute nonsense. And we've got four fire engines. And yesterday I had a meeting with... with the town clerk, he tells me we've only got six functional refuse vehicles. We need a minimum of 11. How can we be thinking? We've got a serious task ahead of us. So it starts with me, but I want to see that reflected in you. And we need civic society to back us up on that, to help us in this exposure and, and accountability. We really can't be serious about our business unless each one of us commit ourselves to this foundational principle. And sorry, I sound like a stuck record, but we are here to serve, not to be served. And it starts with us as councillors, me as mayor, the deputy mayor, the chairs of our committees, and flows down from that. When we set that new standard, then I think we can expect more from the employees in the council, and certainly from residents.